Hi, welcome back everyone. We're going to get some much needed rain over the next 36 hours here. May dodge the bullet on severe weather, but we're keeping a very close eye on how things develop out to the west of us tonight and again tomorrow afternoon. And then we'll see the final verdict on severe weather coming in. A lot of clouds across central Texas from our third street studios in downtown Temple. Looking out across the central fire station in Temple, cloudy skies. Very muggy evening. High humidity values have been a problem for us all day long. This is satellite and radar together, and it's been a busy afternoon and evening out across West Texas. A number of severe thunderstorm warnings in effect right now. We had a tornado watch in effect for portions of Oklahoma and the adjacent areas of Texas, the Panhandle and the uh, upper Red River Valley. A lot of that action has died out now, but we're still tracking a bit of storm activity. This stretches from about Abilene on back up towards uh, the area around Sherman Denison in that area. So there's a lot of action going on to the north of the Dallas Fort Worth area tonight. 88 degrees, the high temperature under cloudy skies in Salado. Our thanks to Tom Breeden for his report. Ed Hewitt, Kurt Krakowian, check it in at 88 degrees with a high there. And in Lamp Passes, Joe Spivey says it made it to 90 degrees at her house. And a lot of places did get that quite warm, that, that warm this afternoon. Clearing skies at times tonight. We're looking at uh, Bartlett. You can see the moon out now, right now, 78 degrees from our studios. Look for a morning low down to 71 as the clouds thicken back up again. 50% chance of rain in the forecast force in the late night hours. I think we're temperature going to get down into the low 70s. This may not occur until about 8 or 9 o'clock in the morning, though. As the sun comes out, we'll still start warming the atmosphere up, but it's going to be generally an overcast sky. And with rain in the picture, I don't think we'll get nearly as warm as we were today. We were about 10 degrees warmer than normal. 83 should be the afternoon high temperature on Thursday. 78 degrees now in Meridian and Waco, 77 in Temple and Gatesville. Colleen's at 76, Lamp Pass is 77. All right, to the east at 78 in Fairfield and Mahia, 77 in Centerville right now. A little bit of rain stretching from southern Leon County on back down towards Huntsville and Conroe. 76 in Cloudy and College Station right now. Here's your forecast model. First thing tomorrow morning, we bring a line of showers and thunderstorms in just to the east of I-35. This is going to be about 5 o'clock or so in the morning. It's going to be moving fairly quick once it gets here and zips on out of here the rest of the day. We're looking at clearing skies out west and a lot of cloud cover back to the east. If we got some moisture here and it's put the sun on top of that, then we're talking about a very unstable atmosphere out to the west of us. Again, looking for the chance of showers and thunderstorms in the forecast for us in the evening hours and then again through Friday morning. Here's your Channel 6 seven day forecast where your weekend is always in view. We're clocking winds at better than 15 miles an hour right now, sustained around 17 to 18 miles an hour. So 10 to 20 mile an hour range for winds tonight, not out of the question. 71 the overnight low, 53 the high tomorrow, 50% chances of late night rain in our forecast. We're going to ramp the rain chances up a bit, 80% on Friday, 30% chances of a lingering uh, bit of precipitation on Saturday morning. I say precipitation, I'm not talking about storms. I think it's probably going to be in the form of some light rain and drizzle if we have anything left over by Saturday morning. Sunday looks like it's going to be nice. Monday, another little system comes rolling in here. And as it comes in, we have a chance of some showers. And tomorrow we got a chance of barbecue. Oh, yeah. yeah. Party on the patio at 5 and 6, Rudy's Barbecue in Waco. We'll see you then. Awesome. Thanks, okay. Andy.